My name is Maybelline San Juan, and I was born on the 15th of June 2001. My star sign is a Gemini, while my Chinese zodiac is a snake. I think it fits me perfectly because I almost have split personalities. I was named by my parents after Filipino child actress on one of their favorite TV comedies, but instead they spelt my name like the makeup brand. They did this because they're in love with the USA, and my name is associated with New York. Don't believe me? My brother's name is actually Michigan, like the state. There are four people in my family, and we like to call ourselves Team Sun One, or Team SJ for short, simply because we are actually a team. My parents, Mylene and Zaldi, were born in the Philippines and moved to Australia in their late teens. If I were to introduce my extended family, I'd need a little longer. When you have friends this close, it's considered family and they deserve an introduction. These girls, Conchetta, Tracy, Tamara, and Antonietta, who is always hiding, are the ones who keep me sane. Even though we may not attend the same school, we're closer than ever. And we get to see each other every once in a while around all our busy and conflicting schedules. These girls are the only ones who truly understand how crazy I am. I have always had a lot of school spirit from reception all the way now to year 9. My obsession with sports and exercise may explain why I run for Gleason at athletics carnivals, even though it kills me half of the time. I also joined in on Saturday morning sports, playing soccer in the winter, even though I knew literally nothing about it aside from kicking the ball into the goal. Basketball was different because I understood it a bit more thanks to my uncles. I also chose to play because it was my late grandfather's favorite sport. As if I wasn't busy enough, last year I did some liturgical dances for the school masses. It was fun because I got to know a couple more people in the beginning of the year. Last year's musical is probably one of my favorite experiences of my life. It was where I met all of my best friends who also love to sing, dance and perform with no shame, just like I did. My favorite color is pink, as you can see from a lot of items in my room. My favorite TV show is Friends, it makes me laugh so hard. My favorite book is The Perks of Being a Wallflower because it helped me get through my first year of high school. And my favorite movie is the film adaptation because it stays true to the story. I'm going to cheat a little and say that my favorite thing in my bedroom is my desk and everything on it because the souvenirs, postcards, and trinkets help me do my homework and focus and remind me of what is important. My favorite item of clothing is my Australian team jacket because of what it represents. And if I were to travel to any place, it would be Paris. I am fortunate enough, however, to call traveling one of my hobbies. I've been all over the world, Canada, America, Asia, and I get to see all these landmarks and different countries and cities with my family because they work so hard to give my brother and I these opportunities. And it's not just about having fun, it's about these life experiences, and I'm truly grateful for it. Another one of my hobbies would have to be collecting and taking photos. I believe that photos are a window to that exact moment in time. I like revisiting these memories because it gives me a rush of joy and reminds me of how many things I've done in the past. It inspires me to do even better in the future. I've been doing Taekwondo now for about seven and a half years. It's turned into a family sport. My mom and my brother also do it with me, but I'm the main competitor. 
I've been all around Australia to compete and I was always known as a little pocket rocket as you can see here. Come on, Evelyn! Yes! 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 Not much has changed since I was a little kid, but I've definitely opened up new doors for myself traveling to Korea and representing my own country. I chose to do drama because I was given the opportunity to get the best of both worlds and study both drama and music. And I can never say no to working with you, Ms. Dabchula, or Ms. Macon. I learn best when I work individually, but in teams I learn best when everyone is participating. I don't really like it when teachers are biased towards certain students, nor do I like it when they treat their class like children, especially now that we're in high school. The thing that worries me the most about drama is the people and group work, but nonetheless, I'm really looking forward to this year. So that's it about me, and I'm sure you'll learn more later on in the year. Dive in. Water might be lovely, girl.